video help, we're going to be going to the property management menu again. We're going to drop it down and we're going to go to the property managers screen. Now, keep in mind that the property manager has a, a small pop-up screen. This is the larger uh, portal version of that same screen. If you wanted to go query that record and or edit or and or look up information within this area. This is the uh, property manager's portal screen. And in the property management uh, manager screen, you would have the name for the item. Let's go ahead and change, by the way. Let's move to another record. I'm going to go prior record. And this one will show you a picture of somebody working on the property. And this might be where they're doing repair or whatever. And it may be something that they're adding or whatever, where they're showing the owner the improvements that they're making. So there's also the ability to pop up and show a larger view of this with this particular button up at the upper other co corner for more detail. It looks like this is the management company having uh, new plants planted in the on the property. I go to the prior record. In case I was on the prior record, let's go to the next record. And you can see in this case, there's construction going on to replace a kitchen. And if I wanted to see it in detail, I could pop it up and then see all the work that's going on in detail. And this would be more for the property owner than it would be for the uh, the tenant, obviously, because this is something that may, may involve uh, improvements. There might have been, a say, a fire or something in the kitchen, and this would replace uh, the information that was in there. And you can see in this case, it's a sample record, so not all the data is included. In this case, if it was a tenant situation where the tenant uh, caused the damage or whatever, you would get them to sign off on the damages, uh, indicating uh, what it looked like before and after the uh, situation that occurred and this would be mainly for the insurance company where you can see that the uh, tenant did recognize the damages and how it was done and then the corrective action that was taken and this, these are scrollable fields so it's quite easy to uh, scroll. Keep in mind if you're going to use this for a uh, on the desktop or on the cloud you would have to paste the signature in but if it's on the iPad the user can actually sign right into this field. Uh, on the iPad, this field will enlarge so that it's easy for the uh, person to sign in that field area. And that way it would endorse the uh, contents of what was done on this record. If you have any questions, as usual, you can always contact me on the chat on the support site. Thank you.